SMT Nation, we back. Nation, Verizon just kind of switched things up a little bit. All right, they're going to be selling their home internet through Total by Verizon. All right, so let's let's run through this, right? They sell Total by Verizon home internet. It's Verizon home internet. Straight talk. Uh, you can get a discount through Visible. They got their regular postpaid service. They got like seven different ways to get their home internet. This is crazy. But uh, let's discuss this offer, how Total by Verizon is doing it. And uh, what you need to know about the service if you're in the market for it, maybe it'll be good for you. All right, let's check it out. Link for the webpage, Total by Verizon. I'll be sure to put that for you guys down in the description. Uh, you can support us in lots of different ways, like and share this video. Of course, if you're new here, first time watch, well, first time seeing my content, definitely subscribe and uh, stick around and watch more videos. If you want to support us directly, there's ways to do that. It's in the description box down below. All right, so here's what they are doing this total by verizon they're going to sell you verizon 5g home internet and they're advertising a price of 45 dollars per month all right now if i click on the little info option it says the first month the service is 50 so i'm guessing it's 45 dollars if you auto pay but the first month you can't auto pay so it's 50 so 50 for the first month and then i think you'll auto pay the rest of the way it'll be a five dollar discount okay so that's cool. Uh, let's see what else they have to say about this. Uh, it says here, 45 bucks per month plus tax and fees. You got to pay for the router. Okay, we're going to get to that in a second here. No contracts over the Verizon network. 5G and LG, LTE coverage, I think both are included. You will get different speeds depending on your connection. So that's an important thing. We'll check that out here shortly. Uh, you will be fully unlimited. There's no type of data caps. Or, or anything like that with respect to like deep prio or slowdowns there is however going to be a threshold of service that you get okay so if you're on the lte service your download speeds will be 20 to 50 megabits per second and it says here um 5g will be like 20 to 100 megabits per second with uploads between 3 and 10 megabits per second so you're experience is going to vary depending on your connection it'll be the same router regardless speaking of the router uh you plug and play it's really nice easy and convenient to set up but uh that thing's going to cost you 99 dollars. and i i guess you just it's like a deposit maybe you just return it when you're done right and then uh you get your 99 dollar deposit back or something like that but it says router sold separately here so i i guess you buy it I just don't know what you do with it after. Uh, so that that's that's something I don't really know about there. Uh, but that seems to be everything they have here. Again, no overage fees, no data caps. They don't even monitor usage. They're obviously throttling it in terms of the bit rate very aggressively. So that's, that's pretty much all they want to do. Uh, but it's interesting to see that they are now selling it through so many brands, right? So they sell Verizon Postpaid. They sell Straight Talk. They sell, you know, this now with total. And I think the total and the straight talk are priced the same. I think those terms are, are pretty much the same. Uh, I don't, the one thing I, I do remember about the straight talk is there was um, a video resolution restriction. I think it was like either 720p or 1080p, if I remember correctly. And Verizon does do that with their postpaid service entry level plan too. You got to buy the plus plan in order to get. 4k video streaming anyways these are all important factors to consider as you guys navigate the fixed wireless access 5g home internet offers you know i know a lot of people prefer the t-mobile home internet a lot of people prefer fiber and cable isps this is just another competitive option you know another way to get service from verizon maybe that rate's good for you you know 45 bucks a month for home internet you know for someone who might have like a modest need doesn't need anything super fast or crazy it might work for you, but uh, tell me what's make or break. Is it the router price? Is it the monthly price? Is it the auto pay? Is it the, the speeds? What's the make or break here? And let me know if you guys think it's going to be successful selling through the Total by Verizon channel. Um, I'm sure a lot of people say that sure is a lot of different ways to sell it. Maybe it's a little bit extra. What say you? Sound off in the comment section below. You are the voice of the people, the SMT Nation. Let your voice be heard.